Welcome back. In today's video, we're breaking down some major coaching changes that could redefine our team's strategy and performance. The Leafs have announced a significant shakeup in their coaching staff, signaling a new direction after a disappointing playoff exit. Assistant coach Guy Boucher, known for his expertise in managing the power play, will not be returning for the 2024-25 season. Despite leading the Leafs to a seventh-ranked power play during the regular season, the playoffs told a different story. The team scored just one goal in 21 power play opportunities during their first round series against the Boston Bruins, which ended in a tough seven-game loss. This isn't the only change in the air. Remember, the Leafs parted ways with head coach Sheldon Keefe in May, shortly after their playoff departure. Craig Berube, who previously led the St. Louis Blues to a Stanley Cup victory in 2019, has been brought on as Keefe's replacement. Berube's arrival comes with high expectations, given his proven track record and a robust .597 points percentage during his tenure with the Blues. Before we continue, let's take a moment. If you're as excited as we are about these changes and want to keep track of how they impact our Leafs, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, have notifications turned on, and have smashed that like button. Adding to the coaching carousel, Barubi brought in Lane Lambert as an associate coach. Lambert, who recently served as the head coach for the New York Islanders, is known for his ability to drive teams to the playoffs, as seen in the 2023 season. Alongside Lambert, Dean Chinaweth will not be returning, marking another strategic pivot in the Leafs coaching staff. Do you think these changes are enough to bring the Stanley Cup to Toronto? Don't hesitate to share your opinions. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next update.